Hello guys and welcome to VHS camera effect tutorial. So in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to install and use this section. So first thing that I'm going to note is that you need to have a uh, high quality pictures like this one. So for example, this picture is uh, 5700 pixels in width and 3800 pixels in height and with a resolution of 300 so I recommend using pictures over over two and a half thousand pixels in width ideally it, it will be picture like this one so um, you need to set a uh, resolution 300 pixels uh, per inch so in order uh, for action to produce the best results um, next thing you need to go is go to image mode and check RGB color and 8 bit slash channel um, next thing you go to your la layers panel here so window layers um, go to layers panel here click on this little box click panel options and make sure that add, add copy to copy layers and groups is checked um, next thing uh, is uh, you need to um, load your image or picture uh, as a background so if your picture is in layer mode like this I mean it, it if it's listed like layers just go to layer new and background from layer and this little lock will pop up from the uh, in the right side in the right corner of your layer um, next thing you need to load the action so I'm gonna show you how to load it so if you don't have this action tab here just go to window and click on actions and it will pop up and uh, now go to this little box here and click load actions and load the VHS camera effect ATN file um, and that's pretty much it just open this click on uh, this uh, action and hit play it will take about 10 to 50 seconds uh, for action uh, to done all the process and you will be left uh, with the default results like this one like this one sorry um, to quickly close down every every folder here just click uh, close all other groups I mean right click on this little arrow here and click close all other groups um, and then hold left alt and uh, left click on this um, uh, folder so now you you are left with four four folders so first folder is overlays so as you can see it adds a little bit more of that nice look to the image so you have these black black sides like a TV but it's it's that um, like a glitch glitchy type effect on the VHS cameras um, you have this glitch overlay so I will zoom in so you can see you see this little uh, like uh, stripes or lines when you hide it it left with uh, plain effect so I'll just turn this up um, next thing is VHS overlay 2 we just add a little bit more of a brightness and you have this one that uh, kinda uh, desaturate the picture and you have less brightness on the on your image um, next thing is date and time which you can uh, change so um, to change this uh, of course you can hide it or you can uh, layer mask it so you can see you can make some cool glitchy type effects with, with uh, date and time also you can do that on the overlay folder as you can see every layer has a layer mask which you can uh, as you can see you can uh, I'm using a arrow brush I don't know why but um, you can um, 
uh, you can uh, layer mask the every layer so you can uh, make some cool effects so to change uh, the date and time just go here and click on the um, smart object and as you can see uh, the font is VCR OSD mono uh, which is a free font on a uh, dafont.com uh, so you can uh, type in uh, maybe AM uh, 11 uh, 46 for example uh, you can change the month um, uh, maybe june uh 12 1996 for example uh, click on this arrow here and hit uh, Control plus s for windows to save this and just uh, close it and the date is changed as you can see uh also you can you have these uh color channels of the date which creates some kind of a, a 3d split glitch effect so you can hide that and just uh, and leave it with a plain plain font uh, also you can remove the stroke but I recommend staying default or you can just hide it if you don't like it so yeah uh, next folder is adjustments so uh, that's just basic adjustments you can make brightness um, whatever you want you can go you can go like this which is cool uh, you can contrast it uh, this is just default effects you can uh, suit it for your needs uh, maybe brightness here uh, contrast you know um, there's a such uh, hue and saturation so you can saturate it desaturate it um, I think it's nice like this um, next folder is VHS effects um uh you have uh, uh again uh, as the date and time you have uh color channels as you can see which creates that uh kind of uh, glitch effect so you can move them around maybe like this or just use your arrow keys to the right and left um and also you have a layer layer mask over it so you can um, maybe if you want to focus on these folks here um, for example and you have a, a background with effect uh, background with effect layer just uh, without these color ch channels as you can see um, and then you can check it uh, with a plain background that you started with so you can just click and drag it oops I forgot to turn this on <laughs> so yeah um, the uh you can um check the before and after pictures just click and drag till uh to vhs effect and bam you have a your start uh, starting picture so yeah and that's pretty much sums sums it up uh, i'm just gonna do it on another picture here so it's the same process just hit play and wait till finished and uh, f uh, on some pictures the date is too small and you can fix that by um, just selecting the date time folder and just drag it and uh, put it where you want it you can drag it like this you can yeah you can scale it it's a smart object so we will won't lose the quality so when you hit uh, OK it, it won't lose the quality 
um, and it's the same process here you can adjust it uh, you can move your color uh, co uh, color layers um, overlay and basically that's it that's the whole action let me just edit this a bit maybe a little more glitch effect yeah it it creates that old national geographic or animal planet uh type of show um and that's it i uh, hope you guys like uh, like this tutorial um find it helpful so go subscribe on my youtube channel here go uh, and follow me on graphic river for more future actions um you have a link description here to buy this section um uh, you have uh, my portfolio also graphic river portfolio in the description uh hope you guys enjoyed uh thanks for watching and see you in the